Ready to you, Ms. Vishnada. Have you ever wondered how our skeletal system are formed? Our hair and muscle. How does it form? Well, our body is made up of the heat. Actually, it's floating water and fat. Human body is made up of almost entirely protein according to Atso Aku Mercurial Co. LTD. Our body has 16% of body composition which composes the muscles, bones, organ skins, and nails. How do protein form in our body? Let's go take a look closer at our cell. Here is the cell. Inside of it is the nucleus which contains the DNA. DNA is completely packed of genes which contains the blueprint of an individual. Before it forms protein, it has to be underwent two processes, the transcription and the translation. What will happen in the transcription and translation? In the transcription, the DNA will be used and separated by what we call RNA polymerase to begin the formation of making RNA. During the process of transcription, the information stored in the gene's DNA is passed to a similar molecule called RNA in the cell nucleus. Both DNA and RNA are made up of genes of building blocks called nucleotides, but they have slightly different chemical properties. The type of RNA that contains information of making protein is called mRNA, since it carries information going out from the nucleus to the cytoplasm. Amazing! So, what will happen after transcription? It is where the translation begins. Translation, the second step in leading from a gene to a protein, takes place in the cytoplasm. The mRNA interacts with a specialist complex called ribosome, which reads the sequence of mRNA nucleotides. Each sequence of three codes of three nucleotides called codon usually codes for one amino acid, which is the building blocks of a protein, for example, AUJ or star codon, initiates the process of translation. Meanwhile, tRNA, a type of RNA, assembles the protein, which it only accepts one amino acid at a time. It is where also the elongation process happens. Protein assembly continues until the ribosome encounters a stock codon, a sequence of nucleotides that does not code for one amino acid, and that protein is formed. Thank you for sharing me this information, Nikki. Now I visualize how these tiny creatures live in the God's work and how able these things form in our body. You're welcome, Rochella. As BKSA Inger says, health is a state of complete harmony of the body, mind, and spirit. When one is free from physical disabilities and mental distractions, the gate of the soul opens.